to get that heart rate up, our fitness expert, Brent Bishop, is here. And this is your specialty. We talk all the time about the exercises you need to do in the gym to work everything, you know, in your body. But these are sort of different things that you might not have thought of doing. Absolutely. Quirky, exercise quirky should not be boring. And these are some great ways to actually make it a little more fun. And that's and what we, we all need. That. more fun in our lives, right? Okay, so we're starting with the ropes. We are. You're starting with the ropes. I'm starting with the ropes. <laughs> so Can you tell <laughs> he's a trainer? <laughs> Okay. So you're going to pick up the ropes. You're going to get into a partial squat, and we're yep. just going to go double arms. So, yep, unilateral, one at a time, and you want to get that undulation going nice and quick. We can go quicker than that. Quick, 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 quick. Good. So you feel your shoulders. You feel your core. I feel it all, your legs. <laughs> all endurance, muscular endurance here. Try that for about 10 minutes. Well, I'm already, like, losing breath right now. So that's a very good workout. So there's many different exercises Woo! you can do with that, but the point is it's a, it's a great little interval you can add in between some strength training exercises as well. Absolutely. Yeah. So this sort of thing, even if you're doing a little timed, like 30 second yeah, 30 situation, seconds that's Go really going to gonna make things harder for Absolutely. you. Absolutely. Bring the cardio into it. Okay, let's talk a little bit about things you can um, wear. Yeah. So we've got a couple of things. We've got a weighted vest, got but also a parachute. Let's start with the parachute. I, lo I love the parachute. It's, um, so essentially, it's, it's a parachute. Yeah. <laughs> you put a belt around your waist. Yeah. And uh, you need a little bit of wind resistance, so you got to run very fast. So it's a great way to train for you know your aerobic conditioning, your anaerobic conditioning. You want to know what that looks like? It there looks like that. So <laughs> can we give it up for Brent? That's him running down the street, looking amazing. That is going to give you a good workout. So we all know when you can add some resistance or add some weight, you're going to sweat a little bit more, burn some more calories. Absolutely. The weighted vest is going to do that. Sometimes for you. you don't want to carry any weight, so you can actually wear your weight. So this vest is about 20 pounds. You can take weight out. You can add weight to it as well. Yeah. But you can it's do heavy. basically anything with it, running, step ups, push ups, planks. Um, so it's just a great way to add some weight without actually carrying dumbbells, right? If you're doing your workout and you find that it's actually getting easy for you, this is weight. a good thing to add, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Okay, so now I want to know what this thing is here. It looks very cool. It looks like a slip and slide. It is very cool. I'm going to put on my booties and I'm about put to show you. booties. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so this is going to work all different parts of your body? Yes, mainly the lower body. It's okay. great for sports-specific training, things like hockey, um, training for the ski hill, for instance. But I will advise you got to be careful because it is yes. extremely slippery. Okay? okay. So pushing off one side, this is one of the exercises you can do. It's kind of more Whoa, like a, a skating exercise. that is exercise slippery. Back and, forth. and you got to really control your center of gravity to make sure that you don't fall. That's amazing. But I mean, anything from that to more hip, uh, like hip stability exercises, you know, where you can work on your hip mobility. Yes. Um, planking, you can do a lot of different things, sliding planks. Nice. Um, great way to train for sport specific. You can probably do like hamstrings, right? You yep. can do bridges with your feet sliding in and out. I think exactly. that's amazing. Exactly. That's cool. A cool toy. Cool I tool, love it. For sure. Okay, so we also have back here, oh, this, the vibrating roller. Yes. I love the idea of this because I love to roll. I don't do it often enough, but if my roller had a vibrator, I might do it more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just See, saying. Funny enough, funny enough, I mean, it actually feels really amazing. I'm sure so it I'm does. I'm going to get you to try it out. Well, we'll start turn with, it we'll start on. With speed one. I'm not going to go too crazy with this. Okay. First. So you're going to do a side lying position like you're, you're rolling out your IT band. So the okay. side of your leg, okay, which is a common area of tightness. Absolutely. Okay, now before you start, press this button, middle button here. Okay. Feel that? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to see it. It feels good, doesn't it? Yeah. Is oh, that boy, just on number no, one? No, no. Okay, because that, was, that was a little There's intense. Three. There's three. That's okay. intense. So this, you're going to yeah. get double duty. You're doing the rolling anyways, but this is really stimulating the muscle, like breaking well, it up. You're, you're loosening up the fascia that's over top of the muscle. You're yeah. driving circulation to the area. It's great for recovery, and it's also great for warm-up as well. Absolutely. Yeah. There's two minutes left in this segment, and I'm staying here for it. <laughs> get out of there. <laughs> it's joking. And, and it moves on its own. It's rolling. Stop Make that, Make sure you baby. turn it off when you're done. That's, that's okay. the key message. Very cool. <laughs> I suggest you all try that at home. Okay, let's see. What is this one here? This what is a do? three in one um, step. So basically, you can add levels to it. So it's for step ups and that type of thing. Yeah. And also swivels. So you can take the swivel aspect cool. out of it. Um, the swiveling will be great for things like planks. Ooh. You know, you can get your lower body involved, push ups. Oh boy. Twisting yeah. all that crazy stuff. So very good. Good, very functional tool. Three exercises in one. All that core stuff that uh, we should be doing all the time. Yes. And this similar. So similar. Yeah. So anything, it's, again, it's more of a balance board. So for yep. stability, working your stabilizers, squats, the twist that you're doing there, getting your core active. Again, you can go hands down into a hand plank position. Right. Swivel as well. So there's you know similar, a little bit uh, more simple. Yes. Very yeah. cool. I love it. 
portable, yet Very you can portable. take it with you. All different things that will help you to just vary your workout. Yeah, a just make it bit. fun. Add something new, right? The variety is key. Fun. A parachute makes things fun. A parachute makes things <laughs> very fun. Okay, you've got one more. Okay. Is that a weight there? This here? Yeah. It's a shake weight. A shake weight. So essentially, not one of my tool choices for exercise, but okay. you know, <laughs> it's uh, it's interesting. Very interesting. Depends what you're. <laughs> It depends what you're training for, right? You want to even out both sides, maybe? I don't know. I don't even know what, I, what to say to that. Okay, so what, what does this actually do? Again, joint stability, muscular endurance. If you, you know, all jokes aside, if you try yes. this for, do that for about a minute, you're going you to feel everything You can start to feel it already. Yeah. You can start to looks, feel it already. You know, it looks crazy, kind of like the parachute, but not as cool as the parachute. Not as cool. Definitely not. I'll, I'll leave that with you.